Prosecution, you got a cross? Yes, Your Honor. Proceed. Let's talk about laws, Mr. David. Do you ever remember taking anything that didn't belong to you? You ever remember stealing anything? No. No? No. You don't remember taking flowers? No. From a dead woman's no. memorial? Oh, that? Wow. Do you remember taking a golf club out of a coffin? It was my five wood. You pried the club out of a dead man's hand. OK, so you know when you get attached to a club, you don't want to give it up, even if it's in a coffin? Well, that was that five wood for me. Did you ever bribe a city councilman? Do you remember breaking into the house of the head of the city council in order to take a letter from Mr. Vindman that incriminated you? Ladies and gentlemen, Larry David undermines our free and fair elections. He is exactly who the Election Integrity Act was built to protect us from. Objection, Your Honor. Overruled. Really? Yeah. Let's go back to uh, the year 2000, if we could, please. Larry David, this is from the Los Angeles Times. It's an obituary written by you. Could you read it to the jury, please, sir? Devoted sister, beloved cunt. Oh! Huh? Well, it's a typo, don't you see? It's a typo! The fact is, I've heard that she actually was a bit of a cunt, but that's still no excuse to put that in a newspaper. I have no further questions. Thank you, Counselor. I've talked to Larry about signs for this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so my question is, where the fuck are the tapes at? Tapes? Larry, the tapes. Larry won't give that shit up. The tapes. What tapes? The fuck tapes. Who the fuck I'm talking about? No, I don't. Every week, you get new ass, right? Every fucking show, mm -hmm. you meet some new chick. Well. And I know you fucking. Mm -hmm. You gotta be fucking people. I did. I did. I had them all. Of course, man. Yeah. Come on, man. And it's all on tape. I don't know how you knew. I figured the shit out. That's yeah, fine. yeah. But they're on Laserdisc. Oh. Do, you, do you have a player? Fuck me, man. Yeah, sorry. No way to convert that yeah. shit to something else? No. That's a shame. It's 13 unbelievable hours. What a fucking waste of time. Yeah, man. I might sell it to Netflix. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't change the fact that this law is unconstitutional. Yes, Larry David did a lot of things wrong. But this time, he did something right. And now, you have the opportunity to do something right, too. Thank you. Thank you, Counselor. Mr. Mack. Yes, Your Honor. I know some of you may not like this law, but he broke it. And this is an incredible opportunity to put away somebody before they hurt other good people. We are just scratching the surface of the depths that this monster will go to. There's a police report that exists stating that Larry David would not give candy to children on Halloween. I don't, I don't think so. He broke into a graveyard to move his mother's body. This is nice. Oh, yeah? He brought a sex offender to a Passover Seder. He ate a dying dog's last meal. Oh, that is really good. And he fornicated ah. with a blow-up doll in broad daylight. Oh, my God. I made you a pillow share. He taught what? a child how to make a swastika. What was his name again, Larry? Hitler. Get in the car. He hired a prostitute so that he could drive in the carpool lane. I had sex with my uncle. And he pretended to be an incest survivor named Todd. This man was asked to go to a dinner and just be cordial. And he couldn't even do that, folks. He couldn't even be cordial. Good people, you have one decision to make. I trust you'll make the right one. Thank you, Mr. Mack. Jury will now begin their deliberations. All rise. Court is adjourned. How do you feel? Confident. <laughs>